what are you going to do? Oh my God, I'm stressed out. The following program is rated TV M-A-N-O-C. It contains a big pair of nuts directly on your chin. It is intended only for mature audiences. Viewer discretion advised. What's going on, fam? It's your boy, Papa Swolio, back with some more nuts on your chin. Look at this hair. It is everywhere, and I'm feeling right. I'm feeling tight, and we have a wonderful Swole Fam sack cess story for you today. Remember, you can check all the links down below. Not everyone has awesome shit in their down below space, in their description area, but Papa Swolio and the fam does. This sack cess story, how important it is for your circle to be tight. That's what she said, tight, tight, tight. You need to make sure you're surrounding yourself with the right people, with the right environment, with the right things, with the right structure. If you are trying to eat better, if you're trying to stick to your nutrition, if you're trying to train better and train more consistently, and you're surrounding yourself with crappy people that are pulling you off that track, or you're putting yourself in situations that will not take you further towards your goal, it's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Well, let's get a great example of how to lock your shit down. This post is from Martina. And she says, hey everyone, this is my first accountability report. I joined the Swole Fam two weeks ago, so I thought this is a good moment. In that time, I lost four pounds and weighed in at 304 pounds this morning. I know it doesn't sound like much, but I'm a bit proud of it. This past week has been very stressful and I was tempted to fall back into my bad eating habits more than once. What really helped me move on was the Swole Fam. Thanks to all of you, I was able to keep up eating better and working out. Whenever I started feeling weak, I logged in here to read about your stories and progress, making me refuse to give up. It doesn't matter how slow the progress is, as long as we all keep moving and working towards our goals. Thank you, hashtag community. Now, if you don't know, you can go download the seven pillars of Swolnormous. It's right there at the top of SwolnormousX.com because at the end, she used the hashtag community. And that's pillar number one, what your environment is like, who and what you are surrounding yourself with, what environment you're putting yourself in. It's up to you. Who are you surrounding yourself with? Are you surrounding yourself with crappy people, with awesome people, with people that exercise, that care about their health, with people that eat junk food and don't care about their health? I also want to congratulate you, Martina, because it says that you joined two weeks ago and in that time you lost four pounds and you say you know it doesn't sound like much but you feel a bit proud. You should feel fucking amazing. Four pounds in two weeks. I feel like I have to reiterate this over and over again. Martina, you are crushing it. Can everyone in the comments down below, any of you that have lost weight or lost fat, at any time in your life, drop in the comments below what your pace of weight loss was. Because one to two pounds a week is amazing. And I think that's one of the most important messages that I can keep on reiterating, is this lack of understanding that one pound a week, it doesn't sound like much, but it's huge. I mean, if you lose a pound a week, you're losing 52 fucking pounds a year. That's amazing. You're losing two pounds a week, that's 104 pounds a year. That's a lot of fucking weight. Now, weight loss is not linear. It's not like the more exercise you do and the less you eat, you just keep on losing forever. That's not how it fucking works. But losing one to two pounds a week is amazing. And we have to give more credit when credit's due. People don't realize how much effort and how much of a huge change that is for the human body. It's amazing progress. And that's one of the downsides from seeing all this transformation nonsense. It's always lost 50 pounds or lost 75 or lost 100. What about losing two pounds a fucking week? That's how they lost that fucking weight. That's how any transformation that's worthwhile having happens. Someone lost a little bit or gained a little bit over time. It takes time to build. It takes time to grow. It takes time to lose. It's just those small habits. Martina, you're crushing it. But this is a fucking example. People are beating themselves up for having amazing fucking progress. We're so disconnected from what real progress actually looks like. She's losing two pounds a fucking week. That's amazing. And she's like, I know it's not a big deal, but I feel a little bit proud of it. You should feel fucking amazingly proud. Martina, I'm so goddamn proud of you. I'm so proud of you and everyone in the Swole Fam is proud of you as well. So drop some support for Martina. Fam, you need to have this in your circle. You need to have people in your circle. The reason why she is posting this is because she joined the Swole Fam. She surrounded herself instantaneously with tons of people that want the best for her because they want the best for themselves. I'm part of the Swole Fam. Pop in the fam. It's like a fucking band, but I'm a part of it too. 
And when you surround yourself with good people that want good for themselves, I want the best for me. And everyone wants the best for themselves. So by default, we want the best for each other. We're just inspiring one another to do better, to want more, to put in more effort, to fucking crush it. So if you're not crushing it, if you're not happy with where you are, this is what it means to surround yourself with good people. They reinforce the good shit that you're doing. They clear out the fucking nonsense. They knock out those fucking demons, those little quiet voices in the back of your fucking head that try to keep on telling you to screw up, to eat that fucking garbage, to take a day off, blah, 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 blah. Those fucking weak voices. We stomp those the fuck out. So drop a comment down below. What do you think? Drop some love for Martina. And again, if you want to join the Swole Fam and learn more about Swanormous X, check out SwanormousX.com. And I'll see you fam real soon for some more nuts on your chin. Peace. We stay woke, but y'all sleep. Real emo, but y'all sheep. Out in public, she a good girl, but at the crib, she a real freak. New throne for the new king. Same kid, not my streets go. Same gang, got the cheat code. I said, stay woke, we in real emo. I said, stay woke, real emo. Stay woke, real emo. I said, stay woke, real emo. Stay woke, real emo. I said, stay woke, real emo. Stay woke, real emo. I said, stay woke, real emo. Stay woke. Hey, y'all some jokers, y'all a bunch of clowns You will not get a laugh out of me You can talk, but you can't denounce I live a different theology Why I transfer to a new account You just fucked over a prodigy Posted up with a rented crown You are the king of the apology You 